A handheld marine VHF radio is an invaluable communication and safety device. You can get marine weather forecasts and communicate with the Coast Guard and other vessels. Channel 16 is the general hailing and distress channel and is monitored by the Coast Guard and all larger vessels. Many radios will default to this channel when turned on. First, familiarize yourself with your radio's functions so you know how to switch between weather and communication channels. And select a channel. and how to adjust volume. Before making the call, take a moment to gather your thoughts and plan what you'll say. An emergency call to the Coast Guard can make a stressful situation even worse if you haven't practiced. First, pinpoint your location. Exact geographical coordinates, like the UTM, or latitude and longitude, position on your map or GPS are ideal. If you do not know these, be as accurate as possible. You will need to provide the Coast Guard with seven things. One, who you are. Two, your location. Three, the nature of your emergency. Four, what sort of assistance you are requesting. Five, a description of the vessel in distress. Six, how many in your party and how many injured, if applicable. And finally, seven, any additional information that might facilitate a rescue. Here's what an emergency call to the Coast Guard might sound like. Mayday, Mayday, Mayday. This is Sea Kayaker Sandy, Sea Kayaker Sandy, Sea Kayaker Sandy. Position one half mile south of Brulee Harbor, Lake Superior. Have capsized and lost contact with my boat. One six foot sea kayak, yellow. I am alone in water with PFD and wetsuit. Request rescue. Sea Kayak or Sandy, over. This is just one example of a VHF emergency distress call. We recommend you take a maritime radio course to learn how to use your VHF to make urgent safety and routine communications.